Welcome back to Wisconsin Family. We are at Bachman's Pool Spas and Saunas, and we're going to be talking spas today. Hot tubs, I should say. We're hot talking tubs. hot tubs because <laughs> weather's cooling off, and of course, we want to warm up. So, but from hot tubs to swimming, we are now joined by Bill Teagum of Little Strokes Swim Academy. How are you, Bill? Good. <laughs> smells like a pool in here, so that's kind of nice. <laughs> I always think right it smells like. Yep. I always think it smells like vacation because you know you go to a hotel and they bleach everything, and it just right. kind of like, oh yeah, yep. I feel relaxed yep. here. So, Bill, did, good. did you see uh, that Justin tried one of those? What do you call it? The, the endless, endless spa. The I did endless... that a couple. I weeks didn't ago, see that. Ago. <laughs> I have to look at that. I'll clip. send you All the right. footage. Maybe we can right, roll that right now. It was terrible. <laughs> um, uh, Fred said that his dog swims in a more straight line than I okay, do, right. so right, yeah, fair I could use some tips maybe from hey, I've never <laughs> swam in one, so I should, well, I yeah. try it. Um, so, uh, obviously we are into September now, and school has started for just about everybody now. How are your little girls first week of school? They are loving it. Yeah. Um, uh, my middle daughter actually has my oldest daughter's teacher from last year, so that's okay. pretty sweet. We already kind of awesome. knew the routine, and yeah. she's amazing. Um, they're over at Prairie Elementary in Wanakee, sure. and uh, my my oldest is in first grade. Okay. Um, seconds in kindergarten, and then uh, the little one we call it. She started baby school yeah. uh, on Tuesday, <laughs> so uh, yeah, it was pretty. It was a pretty big deal. She yeah. did really really well. Um, day three though at drop off, it's it was a little bit. A little bit sad, sure. so she yeah. kind of knew the routine, and she was like, "Oh no, they're gonna leave me now." <laughs> right. So, but right. I get that at swim lessons too. So anyway, they're, they're all they're all doing great, and right. uh, yeah. I'm I always back. wonder um, what's worse. I mean, like you you see your kid crying because they miss you and they don't want you to leave, or when they say, "Okay, goodbye, Daddy, I'm gonna go off to play now." <laughs> right. you know, that which what breaks your heart more, you know? <laughs> right. Right. Exactly. So it, it, it yep. It's it's definitely a double edged sword. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet the house is pretty quiet now too. Yeah, get stuff done. That's kind of nice. <laughs> well, it's not Castle picking up after everybody. Right, right. You, know. you brought up a really interesting point that being a parent and seeing your little ones off gives you some empathy for the parents and and the kids that maybe get dropped off for your swimming With, lessons. That's a good point. Without yeah. a doubt, um, I hire a lot of um, former swimmers that are parents. Um, we have a very mature. Um, instructor set um, now one because they've stuck with me for a while but two I mean they have a different insight when, when you're a parent you 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 understand what the parents going through up there on deck and uh, it's important to be in tune with that and I, I with my younger instructors because we do hire a few I really have to explain that part thoroughly because it's important to see it um, from that perspective absolutely yeah you're actually looking for instructors right now aren't you at little yeah, strokes yep yeah. um, I'm always looking for instructors honestly if somebody's highly qualified I'm gonna snatch them up we'll, we'll create time for them um, because it can just make our program better um, so we're always hiring for that um, but our newest uh, thing that we're hiring for um, now is we really need a water aerobics instructor um, mm. we need somebody to come in you know once or twice a day um, is kind of a part-time mm -hmm gig. We have mostly seniors that are interested in water aerobics right now, but I think if we got somebody earlier in the morning, maybe we could catch some parents before work, something sure. like that. So um, I'm very interested to hire a water aerobics instructor. That would be okay. awesome. Okay. There you go. That'd be very good. <laughs> and uh, any new staff that you're uh, featuring this fall that you uh, just are new hires? Um, yeah. I, I hired a guy named Dustin Gilbertson. He's from up in Superior, Wisconsin. Um, he, he, he swam all through high school on club and in and, 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 uh, and swim team on, on high school as well. And uh, really good little swimmer when he was, when he was little. Yeah. Now, he's, uh, now he's going to school at MATC, um, looked for a job here in Wanakee, and I was like, oh my gosh, absolutely. So uh, he's great with kids, and he's, he's going to be on the, on the schedule. He's training this session um, and going to be on the schedule for fall two, which starts uh, end of October. Um, and uh, then we also hired uh, a new office staff, Heather Bartels. It's okay. going to be um, uh, occasional weekends and uh, probably Monday and Friday, it looks like, in, in their evening office. So we, we are hiring for office um, sure. staff help as well. So it sounds staff. like that's an add-on to what you had already had in place. Um, yeah, well... Versus, like, replacing somebody who... Well, no, 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 we, we, are, we are actually replacing somebody that went, okay. went back to school out of town. So, okay. um, so we are scrambling a little bit right now, but sure. we're making it work. Yeah, so <laughs> send in your resume, right? That's right, that's right. <laughs> so fall enrollment starts, you said October? Oh, wait, um, you can we, enroll yeah, now. Yeah, so we have been enrolling for fall one. We are starting, actually, starting fall one this week. Um, and uh, that we kind of always have open enrollment as the session goes on. If we have open spots, we'll prorate it for you. Um, but the big thing is if you're thinking about swimming this fall and you can't find a spot for fall one, fall two just started. Uh, fall two enrollment just started, and um, that's coming up quick. So, 
Can we put the two together, so instructors and your enrollment, and that you teach kids like the Olympic strokes, mm -hmm. because you feel it's important, even the little tykes. Correct? Yeah, yeah. So our our program is based on on competitive swimming. My knowledge of competitive swimming, and it's being. Uh, conveyed to, 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 to little kids, um, and so the, the same principles that, that apply to the little ones apply to, to older swimmers too, in terms of balance and breathing and you know overall body position, and then you know adding the strokes from there. And so we teach the four competitive strokes to keep it simple. We don't we don't do any side stroke or elementary mm -hmm. backstroke. We just do the four competitive ones. Yeah. Um, Sometimes we've had parents say, "Hey, can you teach them elementary backstrokes?" Sure, we'll do it for you. You know, but like in general, we uh, we we just we stick to the four competitive strokes. And you know, I just had my first two-year-old doing a legal butterfly. The other oh wow! Day, so that was pretty amazing. <laughs> that I was is awesome. Pretty happy about that. You're so, puffing your chest up for yeah, that. That's absolutely. Cool. That's that was cool. that was impressive. Bill Teagan from Little Strokes Swim Academy. We we'll always enjoy having you here. So. Thanks. Don't go away. There's more Wisconsin family coming up after the break. Stick around.